What up everybody? Welcome to 100 Proof Emma. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a mezcal mule. So the difference between a mezcal mule and a traditional Moscow mule is that a Moscow mule is made with vodka and today I'm going to be making it with mezcal. I have a ton of free little bitty samples laying around the house. This is a Brujo number no. 4 mezcal made in Las Salinas, Mexico. So that with a little bit of ginger beer, I'm gonna use a half ounce of lime, and that's it. Bada bing, bada boom, you're done. You're gonna love it. I will too. Personally, I'm not a huge vodka fan. It's gonna take a lot of work to turn me on to vodka. I am a big smoky mezcal fan, so let's try it out. All right, so first of all, I'm gonna use two ounces of Brujo mezcal. Wow, see, that is a difficult cork. Okay, so two ounces. Then I'm gonna fill it up with a half ounce of lime juice. I already pre-batched that. And I'm gonna to top it off with ginger beer. Traditionally, you'd wanna do two ounces mezcal or vodka, a half ounce of lime juice, four ounces of ginger. Um, liquor doesn't affect me as much as it does most people. <laughs> just say that. So I'm just gonna go a little heavier on the liquor. Um, gentle stir. And I don't have any mint or lime wedges. Actually, I do have a lime wedge. Just kidding. Hold on, be right back. I'm back. I cut up a little slice of ginger itself because um, I like ginger and it makes me feel healthy. Okay, let's try it out. Okay, uh, mezcal mule. Wow, I'm liking that punch, baby. Man, that's some good stuff. Yeah, definitely a lot more character than it would have been had I have used some um, traditional vodka. Uh, ginger beer really seems to like mellow the mezcal out a little bit, which is good because mezcal can be a little overwhelming. You have to be super careful whenever you choose that. Um, this is a little bit harder to find mezcal. Just use a basic mezcal, you can find it at pretty much any liquor store or vodka. Um, I use the San Pellegrino ginger beer. I'm a big fan of San Pellegrino. And like I said, my neighbor's limes had no idea that I was taking their limes until I see this video. But thank you so much, guys. You've been great to give me all your produce all year. Okay, cheers. Love you. Bye.